In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a simple yet useful mod for GTA 4 using ivck.net with which you can toggle your HUD and radar on and off simply by pressing a key. Let's get started. Start by opening Visual Studio, create a new project, select a class library.net framework, give your project a name, I'm gonna call it uh, IV toggle HUD radar, set a path. Okay, it's already set, perfect, and hit create. All right, I'm gonna delete this default class and create a new one called main, cause that's what I always do. I'm gonna rename the internal keyword public, uh, right clicking on references, add reference, and browse for the ivsdk.net wrapper.dll. Hit add, and okay. Now we're gonna do uh, using ivsdk.net, now we can derive our main class from the script class, create a constructor and we're gonna subscribe to the key down event. Like, not like so, like, what the fuck? Uh. Oh, I'm stupid. Okay, this didn't work because we need to add the system windows.forms assembly to our project. So let's do that. All right, now we can write key down plus equals and hit tab to insert. Now we have subscribed to the key down event. Uh, let's also do that. I like that more. Remove some of those. All right, what we're gonna do now, let's right click on our project, hit properties and add the dot IVSDK prefix to our assembly name. Now we can build our project and open folder and file explorer, bin debug. Let's create a new INI file called the same as our project name. Uh, let's give it a main section and a toggle key. Uh, let's make it X for now. All right, I'm gonna move that to my second monitor. Let's also subscribe to initialize event here. From here we will read the settings in the IV toggle hardware.ini file. So public keys uh, toggle key uh, this doesn't need to be public uh, private yes all right let's try to read the key from the ini file toggle key equals settings dot get key section will be main the key will be toggle key and the default value will be also x so now in the main key down method, if e dot key code is equal to toggle key, then if the menu manager dot um, what was it again display dot um, let's check for the radar mode. If the radar mode is equal to zero, then let's do this and an else block. All right, if the radar mode is equal to zero. That means the radar is off. Then let's turn it back on. We set the radar mode to one. Thanks, intelligence. And also we turn the HUD back on. If the radar mode is not zero, then we turn the radar off and the HUD off. All right, and I think that's it. Let's build it. Um, open the debug for, let's do it again. Bam, bam, bam. All right, so now locate your GTA 4 folder and inside the ivsdk.net scripts folder, this doesn't belong here, copy the ini and the ivsdk.dll file and let's test. All right, Nico is invisible, that's perfect. Let's press X and there we go. Let's press X again, everything works. The source code for this mod will be available in the description below and of course I will upload this mod on GTA Insight and also on my GTA Forums workshop page. Check that out if you like. Thanks for watching.